I feel like crap. <laughs> like absolute, absolute crap. I've got a headache and like sinus issues and earache and body ache. Everything just feels a bit wrong today. And it's the most inconvenient day for it because the kids aren't with us. Um, they're with Jenny and Paul today. I've got a hair appointment in like half an hour and then I'm going to Norwich and we're going to see Mamma Mia with Mum, Julie and Nan and Sue. So we're going to really do with not feeling like pants. Not feeling like I want to curl up and die. <clears throat> I'm literally wearing Olbus oil as a perfume today. That's how poorly I am. It's dotted all around the collar of my top in a hope that I can breathe. So I've got every type of medication under the sun. I've got cold and flu sachets, I've got cold and flu tablets, I've got Nurofen, I've got sore throat tablets, I've got a smoothie, <laughs> I'm going to try and make myself feel better. Um, but yeah, so hair appointment is first and I'm going for a blind restyle. So my friend Lou who owns a salon is literally just going to sit me down and do whatever she wants to my hair. Um, I'm a bit nervous, I'm a bit nervous. I've set certain parameters, like I don't want a fringe and I need to be able to tie it up, but other than that, it's all in her hands. So uh, let's see how it goes. Here we go. Hi Lou. <laughs> Why do these mirrors always make you look so rough? I don't know. Is it a magic thing? Because once your hair's done, you look great. But yeah. prior to that, you just look there's like, like a switch, isn't there, on the yeah. side? Someone's obviously like behind the mirror saying, right, we need to the switch now, guys. <laughs> yeah, okay, we're good to go. <laughs> and done. Um, but generally speaking, they are like the um, circus mirrors. Mm. Um, there's somebody behind them. Yeah. Definitely. I would quite like there to be a model behind. Yeah. Like the, oh, is that me? Oh, somebody oh. who's size six and beautiful. Yeah, that would be perfect. <laughs> This is the new hair, all curly, clearly not going to stay that way, but it's very pretty and I like it. Um, we are, I'm just waiting for mum to sort herself out of it after work and we're now heading up to Norwich to mooch about a couple of shops, try and find Erin a new coat, uh, have some food and then go and see Mamma Mia. I still feel like crap. I don't know what it is. I don't want to feel like this. I don't like this. But yeah. Hopefully food might sort me out a bit. That's close. Look at the colours. Pretty colours. Hiding a lot of grey under there. Yay. What is it about having kids that gives you a lot of grey hairs? I had none, really, until Arthur came along. And now Erin's here and it's like half my head. It's just grey. It's not fair. But yeah, she's done a good job of hiding them in highlights. Thank you, Lou. <laughs> That's a bird. It's a very fat mouse. <clears throat>
really good view.